Content's a big issue for sales organizations today. Uh, and there's a few reasons for that. One is there's just way too much of it. Sales reps spend anywhere between one and two days per week looking for or creating content. It's a big sinkhole of time. The second thing is that it's not sales oriented. It needs to be designed for sales. And most content is repurposed, either learning or marketing content. So we need to redesign it just a little bit so it's action oriented and granular so we can connect it to the right sales situation. And the third issue is that you need to be able to track it. Sales content today is just not tracked at all. When you talk to most companies, they won't even know if the content is looked at, let alone being able to connect it to an end result for a sale. Yeah, content can be used in a variety of different ways. It can be used before a meeting as a prep. Uh, you can send it out to a prospect so they can take a look at it and have a better idea of what the meeting is all about. You can use it during the meeting to facilitate a better conversation. And you can certainly use it after the meeting to reinforce what you talked about and prepare for the next meeting. So content is at the heart of any sales enablement technology. You need to be able to create it, to then find it, and then measure it. On the creation side, you should have a way to be able to create rich, high-impact content. Finding it is really important. Today, the content needs to find the sales rep, and that's so important because reps can spend so much time looking for content, and they may not even find the right content. And then third is you need to measure it. So you'll need to know what content is being used in each sales situation. And if you know that, you can then tie that to transaction information in the CRM so you can connect content with actual sales results.